today I decided to film a what I eat in a day video because a lot of you guys are always curious about that stuff. So I'm going to show you what I eat in a day. Today is the Italy version or the room version. And uh, let me just tell you something. Hold up. Let me just tell you something about Rome or something about Italy. All they have to eat here is bread, pasta, and pizza. Anyways, I'm going off on a tangent here. Like I'm saying, like I was saying, I'm filming what I eat in a day video. I'm gonna go through and explain everything that I eat. So yeah, keep on watching. So for breakfast today, I had a. Um, I always start off with a lemon. Yes. Yeah, so I just woke up, and when I wake up, I always. I take a lemon, drop it in my water, and I will drop my biotin. I always drink lemon biotin water or just lemon water before I eat anything. I'm a G because I have no knife and I just opened this up with my fingers because I have lemon water like every day so I'm used to doing that. The lemon. Is in there. Oh, okay. Cleanses and detoxes your body, so, and it's not harsh, so you can do it on a daily basis, which I do on a daily basis. I always stop by a grocery store, no matter what country I am in, and I stock up on lemons, and I just keep them in my suitcase or in my book bag, and that's the honest truth. And then I just chuck them in a bottle of water. Every day, I usually do it before I go to bed and when I wake up. And it keeps my skin clear, it keeps, it detoxes, it, if my stomach's not feeling so good, uh, which I'll get into, it helps with that, everything like that. So yeah, I always have lemon water in the morning and I usually drop my biotin in it in the morning. I'm heading to breakfast. Breakfast. This one? This one? Two five five. Two five five. Mm -hmm. yeah. Two five five. Thank you so much. Thank you. There is nothing here for a vegan. in this hotel like look at this elevator at first when at the first day I got here I thought it was broken but no it's just really dim along with the hallways <laughs> so I'm not gonna lie I do miss Asia um, with every part of me i'm sorry if you can hear cleaning people outside i'm in a, and i'm in a hotel i was supposed to say i'm in a museum i'm in a hotel asia is just heaven for vegans like it's heaven especially or plant-based people because my favorite one reason why it's not hard for me to be plant-based or one reason why it's not hard for me to be healthy is because my favorite foods are plants my favorite foods on this earth come from the earth. My favorite foods consist of fruits and vegetables and grains. The essence of Italy is pasta. Trust me, don't tell me I just been to Rome either. I went to Genova, San Marino, um, Rome, 
Milan Ven uh, and Venice last time I was here. So yeah, pasta, bread, and pizza. Pasta, bread, and pizza. Pasta, bread, and pizza. I'm getting super sick of pasta, bread, and pizza. Not gonna lie, I'm sprint. It's been two weeks and I'm just like, oh, I can't do this anymore. Movies. How cute is this little these little streets? Oh my goodness, look at this ice cream place. Oh. Oh, hey, Jesse. See, everybody has to draw. Salad, pizza. But I want gelato. Jesse, gelato. Spaghetti? Is that gelato spaghetti? <laughs> No, gelato spaghetti. I'm about to get some gelato. Coconuts. Gosh, why the heck is this so big? Oh my gosh, she just gave me freaking I can't finish this. It's already starting to drop. Let me know if you guys like this video if you guys want me to do a video on weight loss. Um and share more about just how I maintain my weight and how I stay healthy. Uh, I always finish off the day with something light. Um I'm never that hungry at the end of the day. Um and I always finish it off with some veggies. I love veggies. So yeah, I always finish off the day with some veggies. Um, I love just roasted or sauteed vegetables are one of my favorite meals ever. And then I always stop eating at 6 o'clock. I know I've talked about this before, but for the people that didn't hear me talk about it, I stop eating at 6 o'clock. I do not eat past 6 o'clock. Um, it's this intermittent fasting lifestyle. Everybody picks different hours. Um, some people eat from like 8. They start eating at 8. They stop eating at 4. Um, some people start eating at 12. They stop eating at 8 or whatever the case may be. I usually start eating at 7 or 8 and I stop eating at 6. Um, you can look at like the, I always tell you guys, don't ever take my word for anything. Let me be the one maybe to introduce it to you, but you do your own research and you figure out, you know, what, what you might be interested in doing or, you know, but, um, yeah, I started intermittent fasting, it changed my life. I love intermittent fasting. Um, and you're really not fasting. Well, you are because Breakfast means break fast, so everybody fasts because when you go to sleep, you're not eating. But I get enough calories, obviously, that the human body needs while I eat. So from hours 7 to 6, I or 8 to 6, I get all the calories and nutrients that I need for that day, for sure. So unless, you know, some things happen, like say I'm on like a 20-hour flight, you know, or something like that, and my hours are weird or whatever the case may be, but for the most part, um, I stop eating at 6 o'clock. That is a big game changer. Um, and you can train your body to where you're not starving after 6 o'clock. I'm not starving after 6. I'm satisfied. I'm good. I just continue to drink water after 6. Um, a lot of people commented last time I mentioned that, but I have a job and I go to work at 6 or I blah, blah, blah. I'm like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, I don't know what to tell you. All I know is 
you know that's what i do and it works for me if you can't figure out how to make it work for you then i'm sorry i'm just sharing the tips with you that i know have worked for me and that i love so yeah i do the intermittent fasting thing so that is what i ate today i always have water all the time all day long i drink about a gallon of water a day um i have for almost two years now obsessed with water i go through water withdrawals like I do not have water for a couple hours i will literally be like my i will can't do anything until i get some so um yeah i think that's everything for this video thank you guys for watching i'll see you in my next one